Plants are known to prefer drip irrigation. This allows them to take in and absorb water slowly, which is ideal for them. Shallow-rooted plants, such as cucumbers, require frequent watering to thrive. A drip irrigation system can also be used for other vegetables and flowers, making it an adaptable option for gardeners. Creating a drip irrigation system is simple and requires only basic materials. First, you'll need a 1 liter plastic bottle. Begin by cutting off the bottom of the bottle. This makes it easy to fill with water. Next, make small holes along the edge of the bottle where you cut it. These holes are necessary because they will be used to secure the bottle to a bamboo stick. Now, make a small hole in the cap. This hole is where the water will slowly drip out. To control the drip, insert half of an ear cleaning stick into the hole in the cap. This will close the hole almost completely, allowing only a small amount of water to pass through. Once the cap is in place, secure the bottle to a bamboo stick with a twist tie. When you place the bottle in the ground, the bamboo stick will help it remain upright and stable. Make sure the bottle is securely tied so it doesn't move or fall over. Once your drip irrigation system is ready, it's time to install it in your garden. Choose the plant you want to water and insert the bamboo stick into the ground beside it. The bottle cap should be just above ground. This position allows water to drip directly into the soil near the plant's roots. You can build as many of these systems as you require for your garden. Once the system is in place, simply pour water into the bottle from the top. After a few moments, the water will begin to drip out slowly. This steady dripping will keep the soil moist, ensuring that your plants receive a consistent supply of water. The beauty of this system is that it waters your plants without requiring any additional effort from you. You can also use compost tea to fill the bottle, allowing my plants to receive food through the drip system. This way, the plants receive not only water, but also essential nutrients, which promotes growth and health. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like it, subscribe, and click the bell icon for more videos.